of all communal organizations, which is the most sacred of them all? In Parshat Vayechi we read, Hayakov was preparing for his death. He told Yosef his son, Ve'asita imadi chesed ve'emet, please practice kindness and truth with me when I would have passed away. Now, what did Yaakov mean? Chesed infers going the extra mile in order to engage in acts of compassion. Emet, truth, means you must do what is right. That's it. So on the one hand, he's saying, do the right thing. On the other hand, he's saying, go the extra mile. Sefer Panim Yafot explains beautifully. Yaakov was saying to Yosef, do what is right, the emet. And that is, as a child, you have a responsibility to bury your father. In addition to that, I would love you to engage in chesed. I would love you to go the extra mile in order to take my remains back to the Holy Land so that I can be buried together with my ancestors. This term, chesed ve'emet, is the slogan of every single Hevra Kedisha in the world. Indeed, it is the Hevra Kedisha translated as sacred society, which to my mind is definitely the most precious of all of our communal organizations. Simply extraordinary men and women who in their separate divisions look after people once they have physically passed away. And within our communities, we're blessed to have their chesed ve'emet. First of all, they do what is right to guarantee that every person will have a burial. And in addition, the chesed that they apply, their acts of loving kindness going the extra mile with such devotion to those who have passed away and to their families is something very remarkable for all of us always to witness. Their kindness is of the ultimate form because the person to whom they are showing kindness will not be able to repay it in any way. It's absolutely sincere. It comes from the heart and it is in the finest tradition and spirit of our faith. You probably don't even know who the members of your Hevra Kedisha are. That's the spirit in which they are operating. They don't do it for any thanks, but let's ensure as communities that we do always express our full gratitude to these most wonderful people. Shabbat Shalom.